The decreed hour is come. Set forth with my blessing, Prince Noctis. Thank you, your majesty. Take your leave and go in the grace of the gods. Right. <sighs> Well, princes will be princes. So much for royal protocol. Not like you had to deliver a formal address. Your Highness! What now? I fear I have left too much unsaid. You place a great burden on those who would bear with you. <laughs> You're one to talk. I ask not that you guide my wayward son, merely that you remain at his side. Indeed, Your Grace. We'll see the Prince to Altissia if it's the last thing we see. Yeah, what he said. Hate to break this up, but Kor's got the motor running. Drados, he's in your hands. And another thing. Do mind your manners around your charming bride-to-be. Your Majesty as well. Try to mind yours around our esteemed guests from Niflheim. You have no cause for concern. Nor do you. Take heed. Once you set forth, you cannot turn back. You think I would? I need only know that you are ready to leave home behind. Don't know about you, but I'm ready as I'll ever be. Take care on the long road. Wheresoever you should go, the line of Lucis goes with you. Walk tall, my son. I think we can forget about hitching our way there. Thought people were friendly outside the city. Yeah, you can only go so far on the kindness of strangers. You're just gonna have to push her all the way. I've already pushed myself... to the brink of death. You'll get up. <sighs> Come on, car isn't gonna move itself. Jeez. I thought the car was supposed to move us. Wouldn't that be nice? Can it? Ready, steady. Oh. Really? Push! 
Hey there, y'all kept a girl waiting. Now, which one's the prince? Aha! Hello, your highness. Congrats on your wedding. Not hitch just yet. Lady Luna Freya's groom to be here in Hammerhead. Apologies for taking so long. <laughs> you best save your apologies for Paw Paw. Well, that makes you. Cindy. Sid's grease monkey granddaughter. Roll her in while I'm still young. Didn't your daddy tell you? She's a custom classic, not some beat up old clunker. Prince Noctis. Uh, yeah. Prince. Like they took your old man and kicked the dignity out of him. What? You got a long way to go, son. And that slack jaw's getting you nowhere fast. She's gonna take a while. Y'all get her in and run along. <sighs> Y'all heard him. Let's get moving. Right this way. Now, we play the waiting game. Uh, never liked that game. Never any good at it, either. Oh! Hey there! Prince! Y'all ain't never been out this way before, have you? Go on, have a look around. This'll make sure y'all don't get lost. Might as well make good use of the extra time. Whoa! They got Ebony out here! Oh, Ignis is gonna flip! Wait, oh, uh, what's a kill?
Man, that smells good. Oh, no, oh, I mean, uh, welcome. What can I do you for? Y'all hungry for info? out with some varmints appreciate it you boys are a brave bunch appreciate it y'all hungry Stay alert. Oh. A moment, knocked. We've expended the last of our funds on the repairs. I suggest we confer with Cindy. Broken down and flat broke. Adding insult to injury. Old man's in for both after charging us that much. Yeah, let's pay him a visit. Any noteworthy news? They've got everything here. Hey, let's see what they've got for sale. We've already brought everything we need. Gonna be ready for a while. Y'all need something? A uh, bit steep for a simple tune up, don't you think? Oh, now I get it. This must be what Papa meant when he said he was gonna teach them boys a lesson. Told me he ought to have y'all take care of some ornery varmints that have been causing a ruckus around here. I'd be happy to pay y'all for your services if you're up to the challenge. How about it? Well, so much for finding an easy way out. Thanks a lot, Papa. But don't go running around after dark. The demons are liable to rip y'all to shreds. Here, this ought to be enough for a place to stay. Just between us, though, don't tell Papa. Wow, they got a lot of different stuff here, huh? That's how it works. Looks like we found our first targets. Ready, knocked. Use 
Gonna know what hit him. Let's do this. Haven't you ever heard the best offense is a good defense? No big deal. All right. We'll be done in no time. Let's get on with it. So, uh, where are we headed anyway? Nowhere until the repairs are done. Then we head for Golden Key. Then after that, we hop a boat, and before you know it, lover boy's hitched. Wait for car repairs? Then wedding bells in the air. Got it. <clears throat> Almost there. Give it your all. See ya. Hey, no. Warp strike to catch him off guard. Don't let us rip from it. I'll say, I'm What can I say? You like that? Solid. Right there. Nice. Mission complete. Who could this be? Hello? Actually, we just finished. That's great, because I got one more hunt for y'all. Only this time, it's for a person. Fella named Dave went off, and we ain't heard from him since. Reckon he staked out a spot in an old shack nearby. Old shack? Uh, oh, got it. We'll take a look. So, what did Cindy say? Needs us to find some Dave guy. He went missing? Not missing. Said he's holed up in that shack. Huh. Saber Tusk guy, it's fresh at a fair price in town, as a wife. And now, we a while to pack him. No functions. Better get him for the dawn. this knocked get out of here you okay we are now spoke too soon knocked yeah now fear Pronto's here that's don't mention it Yeah! 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 
No big deal. We all good? Better than good. Good to go. Hey, what about the shack over there? Not yet. Got a plan. Huh. What are we looking at? This creature is known as a saber tusk. It skewers prey with its tusks, extracting game from the safety and comfort of burrows. That's a bit heartless. Yeah. Hey, Pronto! Stay on your feet! See ya! How are we holding up? Getting by. Feisty little devils! Big weapon like that will leave you wide open. Try another. None the worse for wear. Bring on the next one. Hey, who's out there? Well, and look who's in here. The man of the hour. Dave, right? <laughs> Been looking for you. Didn't mean to cause y'all any trouble. I've been stuck here on account of my sprained ankle. Yeah, something funny about them varmints. I gave them hell, but couldn't finish the job. Still one mean mud about. Well, y'all don't look much like hunters, but what do you say? Put that puppy to rest for me? Sure, we'll do it. Well, for the right price. Y'all got guts, that's for sure. Let me tell you where I last saw them. Phew. For a second I thought you were gonna forget to ask for cash.
wise to rest up before we set out. In that case, let's find a spot to make camp. The hunters are really out in full force around here, huh? So they're the new Crown's Guard or something? Similar, though technically a civilian outfit. They've definitely seen a lot more action than we have. Uh, is it cool that we rock Crown's Guard outfits? Be worse not to. They made them especially for us. Even got a sweet insignia on them. In the Crown's Guard, your attire identifies you. So wear it with pride. Let's call it a day. All right. I'm gonna pitch the tent. Well taken. <laughs> nice work snapping this. I know, right? Oh, really? Like a father to her. Ever since they got back, Sid's been the only one looking after her. Rather more than a middling mechanic can handle. All things considered, I'd say she turned out okay. But like any girl, you just need to treat her right. Treat her wrong and Sid will stuff his wrench where the sun don't shine. Take care of the car and it will take care of us. Yeah, the car.
Ah, <sighs> sometimes I wonder if we'll ever sit inside that beautiful car again. Sitting most of the day was pretty nice. Napping was even better. Over there! That's it, right? Huh. That's a dual horn? Yes, but not your run-of-the-mill breed. We'd best make quick work of it. Wait a sec. What? Scared, big guy? You ought to be, too. Thing's vicious. You sure? Looks tame to me. Yeah. Look out! <laughs> yeah! Show those balls! Nice one. It's not over yet. <laughs> Ready for round two. Bring it. Gladio, <laughs> Tim Ponto, you're up. Huh. Yeah! Nice work, Gladio. Yeah. All cover. Yeah. Yeah. Ponto! Got it! Alright, boys, we're in the home stretch. Dying on me now. You're the one to talk. Was that perfect or what? I'll give you that. Ring, ring. Hello? Hey, Dave just called and said he's safe. Thanks for finding him. Ken? Nice work, y'all. By the way, the old girl's looking good as new. Oh, while I got ya. If y'all want to fix her up before you roll out, let me know. Sounds good. She'll be waiting at the garage. Gotcha. So, who's up next behind the wheel? Ignis should take it and never let go. It helps that he can keep four eyes on the dash. <laughs> I couldn't even keep one. Not sure I'd do any better. Put me in the driver's seat. Good. Because I need the legroom in back. It's rude to keep a girl waiting. You better apologize. Uh, uh, what is that? A live hurricane. That thing's like half bird, half storm, half airship. You realize that's three halves. Well, that explain its size. <laughs> awesome in every sense. Only so far a man can walk. Our Crown City upbringing didn't prepare us for this. Uh, pretend you're walking to the car. Huh! We're here. So, 
Sorry about the wait. Ain't she pretty? She's almost too pretty for the road. She's back. We should all get a picture with her. All the more reason to ride with care. Oh, and before I forget, would y'all mind making a little delivery for me? No, not at all. Perfect. Thought you'd say yes. So I already put it in the trunk. There should be a motel on your way to Galden. If y'all wouldn't mind giving that to the owner, that'd be swell. Grandpa like grandkid. Now that she's all polished up and ready for the road, would you care to take her for a little test drive, Noct? Sure. Why not? And I needn't remind you to exercise caution. While I got you, if y'all want to fix her up before you roll out, let me know. What'll it be?
What coat do you fancy? How do you want the wheels? Well, here's what I can do for her. How about the decals? How's this? Y'all just sit tight now. Well, here she is, just like you ordered. Stock up on potions and stuff. Nice. You're being helpful for a change. What do you mean for a change? <gasps> Hammerhead is like no garage ever. You know? One would expect no less of purveyors to the crown. Ah, <sighs> I'll miss it once this road trip's over with. Huh? There's no reason you can't pay them a visit anytime you please. I'm sure Cindy will be glad to look after your car. Oh, right. So, that's what this is about. If you need, I could always lend you the regalia. Whoa! Huh. Uh, thanks for the offer, but once we're back in the Crown City, I think I'd better squirrel my own wheels. <laughs> Don't mention it. Yeah. You're on fire today! No big deal. None the worse for wear. Man, it's hot. Then lose the jacket. Safety first, everybody!
Wanna team up? Stay close. Got it. Pronto! Pronto! Nice! Now it's time to go to town! Give him hell, Mark! Yeah! How do not get by? That's crossing the line. My hand slipped. Stop! Uh huh? Impressive, no? You've grown stronger. That's be thanks to my balanced diet. The one that excludes vegetables. Yep, that's the one. Going for it! Uh huh? Gotta love it! Now you want to hit him! You know, you might be able to start a challenge. The Prince of Pain. Yep. Careful, don't let him get you. Hey, some reading? Yeah, somehow. How are we? Getting by. Hello. Oh. Yeah, that's Origi. No surprise. 